Hey guys, what's up? Toba Loco here, and today we are back with the 2014 World Cup game. This time we're playing as Eritrea. I've selected them because they're not on the 2010 game. Oh, cool. I, um, I might do some more on this one. Maybe some more on the 2006 one, and definitely some more on the 2010 one. But for today, let's do this. Do we know anything about Eritrea? I mean, they are a new nation on this game, uh, as in... Um, if you know, if you know what I mean, you know, um, they weren't on the 2010 game, but they were on the, they are on the 2014 game, brand new. Do we know any facts about Eritrea? All I know is they're a country in Africa, northern Africa-ish. Um, we're gonna, um, shuffle the groups and just see what we get with. I definitely, definitely, um, changed quite a few of the uh, teams in here, so, one, two, three. Okay, so we got a group. With Mexico, Iceland, and Japan. Okay, then our first match is Mexico versus Eritrea in the Rio G. Janeiro Stadium. Let's see how good Eritrea can match up against these other three teams in the group. Eritrea, very random football team. I don't. What's their best result? Can someone tell me? I mean, someone told me about Laos. Um, that was really um, that was really impressive. Eritrea football, though. I mean, that's going to be a little bit harder to find, surely. Um, I'm sure they probably haven't played that many matches. Um, but we'll see. We'll see how they do on this game. It's cool that you can get nations such as Eritrea and stuff like that. But we're up against Mexico, a decent side. They performed pretty well in 2014. I remember Ochoa being the star of the show in, um, for Mexico. I think I might have a hard time in Mexico. I might have a hard time. So how are we all doing in the uh, world of uh, Tobaloco and the world of real, real life? Uh, saw Bayern Munich won the Champions League. Um, that was recent, I guess, in terms of my upload schedule. Um, also, Messi threatening to leave Barcelona, that he didn't. It's like, well, how typical is that? 700 million buyout clause. Uh, it's absolutely unreal. Like, nobody can afford that realistically. Maybe Man City and PSG, but... Yeah, it's, it's absolutely bizarre. It's, it's, it's bizarre. But here we go. Oh, look at that. It's this guy. I'm not going to say his name because it's going to get taken out of context. <laughs> I just realised his name. I'm not going to say it. Because <laughs> I know that it will. It will. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. I'm just saying. It will get me in a lot of trouble if I try and pronounce it. God, Mexico, please. Can we just get lost? Just for like two seconds? This is on professional. I'm honest with the difficulties I play on, but god damn. Mexico are pressing so much. I reckon our best bet will be winning against Japan and Iceland. I think Mexico are a little bit too established. Um, maybe Iceland and Japan might be able to be the teams that we break down. Over the top through ball, maybe we can do it, do it straight back to Mexico. No, no. Uh, it's going to be very hard to break this Mexican defence down. Like I said, they're a little bit too established, I think. Like, they're too good, and um, I think that... No disrespect to Japan or Iceland, but I think I could probably have those two teams. I wish you'd go towards the ball when I pass it. That's the one main complaint I'm having right now in this game. Oh, that is good play. Here comes Solomon. Solomon. Like the island. Oh, my God. Now, that could have been a pen, but Ochoa made a really good save there. Hopefully we can uh, whip this in and get a score header maybe. Okay, I, was just ex I expected an overhead kick there, but no. I had never heard of er Eritrea until this game, so don't tell me that video games don't teach you anything. I respect it, you know. I'm. Oh wow, okay. Oh, no! That was such a good save. Achoa on his 2014 form, absolutely unreal there to stop Eritrea from scoring. We will do a proper qualifying campaign on this game um, once I get it more figured out, if if uh, this guy would just get lost. No! Oh my god, that was so close. Mexico coming so close there. Oh, that's poor. Oh, that's a really good tackle. And he's missed a sitter. Who was that? Oh, we don't even know. What have I just done there? What have I just done? Oh, oh my god, did that... Oh my god, we have to see that again. I throw it out, he shoots. 
And this moment here literally could have screwed us over. Did it go? Obviously it didn't go in because it's a computer game. But I want to see how... Oh my god, that was literally off the line. Well, we had a bit of a late scare, but we got a draw against Mexico. And, uh, yes. Yeah. Um, very surprised about that, because I thought they'd actually punished me quite a lot. They almost did at the end, but um, Eritrea uh, definitely make, making a great statement in this World Cup. We had a few chances, but Ochoa is a good goalkeeper, so... Okay then, our second match is against Japan. Japan. Not really a fantastic World Cup nation in terms of like finishes and stuff. They say though that if an Asian team were to win it, it was gonna it's gonna be either Japan or um, uh, South Korea. And in fact, actually, just remembering it, Japan almost beat Belgium in a 2018 one. Um, so I guess my comment um, about them not being that great is um, void. Oh my god, Japan, please, no. Oh wow, okay, Japan hit the... hit out the brakes strong, what am I saying? Kagawa scores. Uh, was he playing for Man United at this time? I don't know. I really don't know. But they score... Or was he at Dortmund? I can't remember. He was at Man United for a little bit. Oh my god, another offside. Oh my god, this guy for Eritrea is just constantly offside. Okay, that's... Oh, come on! That's not a foul! Ah, oh, the frustration factor is kicking in already. Stop, Japan. Why are they so high pressing? Like, I just don't understand. If that guy passes to the guy on the wing, I'm literally messed up. Oh, he scored! I didn't think I would! I didn't think Eritrea actually scored that! It's Andabaran! Wow! Okay. And he celebrates in the middle of the pitch. He scored his first goal. I didn't even think that would have gone in. And the Japanese manager is livid. But the Eritreans are loving it. Can we tackle Japan? No, we can't. They just scored. Yep. Brilliant. That's Havana. Doesn't even sound Japanese. <laughs> oh, my God. And now Japan are back on top. Oh, my God. Eritrea, come on. What are you guys playing at? Look at that. Like, what is that? Like, what? What in the hell is going on? That's good play. That's really bad shot. He scuffed that. What are you doing? Absolute idiocy from Eritrea there. They're going to header it. Oh. Japan's aerial game is way better than um, Eritrea's, even though Eritrea has way taller defenders. I'm fairly sure that Eritrea has better defenders. I know it's all about the jumping and stuff, like you may say, but come on. Okay, that was a stroke of luck. But, but the game's like, ha 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 Goodness, Japan! Seriously, do you have to do that to me? That is so annoying. Oh my god, you basically just ruined the video. <laughs> All right, so in Group A, Colombia and Sweden are going through. Nigeria and Anguilla are out. Group B, Ecuador and Wales go through. Germany, look, oh, well, they are out. Ecuador and Wales knocked out Germany. That's pretty impressive. Group C, Portugal and Uruguay go through. Group D, Italy and Egypt. Group E, Croatia and Cyprus look like they can go through. That group hasn't finished yet. My group hasn't finished yet. Um, group G, uh, Korea Republic and Estonia look like they can go through. And Group H hasn't finished. Group H is the, like the biggest group of death ever. Look at that. <laughs> oh my god. Um, France, England, Spain and Argentina. It'll be very interesting to see who will go through in those ones. Here we go, the final match of the group stage and possibly the final match for Eritrea. Definitely the final match for Iceland. Um, I don't know how many goals we'll need. I'm just going to try and get one. <laughs> just one, dude. We scored against Japan and Japan was super aggressive. Like, they were really annoying. No. 
what I hate about the computer on this game is like it always it almost knows what you're gonna do even before you know you're gonna do it. Um, what? I just got thrown off the ball when I tried to do a spin move. Come on. Oh, that's that centre back, man. He just like fucking slid in and got me when I was like basically a, like a few centimetres in front of him. Right, watch this guy get thrown off the ball in the last second. See? How's that more penalty? He just injured him. And he kept it on as well. How did he do that? Oh my god. And he just pumps out the field and my goalkeeper's not going for it. I'm holding the Y button. This game is stupid. Look, this centre back just keeps covering me all the time. Like, what is that? Like, he, he can't do it forever, surely. Just needs to get out. There's no way that he was... Oh my days, how did they... Oh my god, how did they miss that? That ball was ridiculous, and then that to happen. I don't know, we just need a little bit more, like, attack. Let's try that. Okay, this is a little bit better. Oh, that centre-back again! That centre-back again. That Ericsson guy. Who the fuck is in, even his, is he? I can't even speak properly, I'm just so annoyed. Stop! That Ericsson guy is covering me like a fucking blanket. It's ridiculous. Oh my god, offside. How, how is that offside? I tackled him! There's no way! He had the ball and I, oh my, no way is that offside. That, that, uh, can someone explain that to me? That can't be offside, surely. I, d I just don't get it. That can't be offside. That was awful. Eritrea are just absolutely diabolical in front of goal. And diabolical in midfield. And pretty decent defensively, but I'm controlling it, that's why. Laos were better than this team, and that's saying, oh, there we go, that's the nail in the coffin right there. Iceland literally just fucking defended their asses off and got this scabby win against me. Oh my god. <sighs> what an absolute piss take. I mean, yeah, okay, I made the misplay that, like, you know, made Iceland score, but... Oh my fucking god, <laughs> Eritrea is so bad, so bad, you can't even make it up how bad they are, <laughs> done, I'm so done with it, it's so annoying, Eritrea are awful, absolutely awful, oh my god, I can't, it couldn't even, there was no creativity in the squad, there was no, there was no nothing, nothing at all, I finished dead last, Fucking awful team. Italy against Mexico. Okay, that's okay, fair enough. Italy won the tournament. Balotelli literally won everything. Buffon got the best goalkeeper. Let's see how it unraveled then. Croatia losing against Mexico 2 1. South Korea beating Spain 1 0. Colombia beating Wales 4 1. Portugal beating Egypt 2 1. Then Mexico went on to beat South Korea. And uh, Colombia beat Portugal 5-4, uh, Mexico beat Colombia 2-1 and then lost in the final. And, uh, uh, sorry, Colombia beat Benin. Is that Benin? I think it is, yeah. Uh, in the uh, third place playoff. I want to see how this went down. Uh, Benin beat Japan 1-0. See, Benin beat Japan. Come on. Um, then France beat Panama 3-0. And then Sweden beat Ecuador 2-1. And then Italy beat... Uruguay 4-1, then Italy went on to beat Sweden 1-0, and Benin beat France 3-2. What the hell? Um, and then Italy smashed Benin 4-0, Benin went on to lose the third place playoff, and Italy went on to win the whole tournament. So that was your playthrough, sadly, with Eritrea, probably the, one of the worst nations I've ever used. There's not going to be many highlights of that. Anyway, this has been Toba Loco. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, <laughs> hope you enjoyed it more than I do. Enjoy my suffering. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, keep it loco, and I'll see you again for the next video.